Hello guys, my name is Shubhroto and in this video I'm going to talk about the Pixel Experience ROM on the Redmi Note 5 Pro. Okay, so first of all let's talk about the stock camera that we get. Uh, this is the camera that we get and it's the Mi A2 camera obviously. So in this ROM we get the camera to API support. Let me just show you. So as you can see we have all the support and uh, due to this we can install the gcam i have the gcam for android 10 and it works pretty fine i will drop the link in the description below if you want you can download it okay so there's no double tap to sleep option in this rom present but if you slide down it will uh, show you the notifications so we have the double tap to wake up feature available on this phone as you can see and uh, yeah the face unlock is also available in this rom let me just show you in the security options. So we have the fingerprint and face lo uh, face unlock available. Let me just zoom in a bit. Uh, so as you can see we have the face added. So the fingerprint is not that bad compared to the Mi UI as you can see. So let me just show you the Android version uh, that we are getting in this ROM. So about phone and as you can see we have the android version 10 uh, We just have the gestures Jump to camera I've disabled it because there's some problem with my button Anyway we have system navigation Which we have enabled right now And we also have two button navigation Which is basically the home button and uh, recent view will be in one button And the three button navigation that is our usual so talking about the face unlock it works pretty fine let me just show you so it just saw my face and unlocked see it's pretty accurate and fast so we get the dark mode over here as you can see we can toggle it from the notification center and everything turns into black uh, we can uh, share the hotspot in uh, 5 gigahertz also that is a good thing inside the display section we can see the dark theme over here and we have the night light, adaptive brightness, styles and wallpaper. You can see we have crayon, collage. These are just different icon styles and uh, fonts that we can choose from here. We can change the font size. The display size can be also changed. That's pretty normal with every ROM. So talking about playing games, uh, PUBG runs quite good in this ROM. Press the power key and the volume up key uh, that will take you to the recovery mode. So we are in the recovery mode. I have currently the Orange Fox recovery project installed in my device. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is uh, create a backup. I will show you the process after the backup is done. Okay, so while the backup was going on, I put the phone on charge and I have quite a good charge to continue this video so the backup is about to end the digest is being created so let's see so as you can see the backup is complete right now so we are good to go so first of all we'll go and wipe the data the system dalvi cache uh, cache vented data uh, we'll leave the internal storage and sd card and all other things and we will swipe to wipe this will take a second and after that we can go back so now we have to uh, find the rom that we have downloaded and install it so mine one is saved into downloads as you can see pixel experience so now i will uh, swipe to install so the installation has started and it will take quite a good time so i will uh, get back to you when it is installed so the installation is complete now we can now reboot the system and boot into the pixel experience that is based on Android 10. Thanks for watching this one. I hope you liked it. If you did, then don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Any feedback is appreciated, and I will see you guys in the next one.